Hi, I'm Team Smart Pack Rider Shannon Duick. Today's Ask a Trainer question comes from Devin, who asks, What are some good exercises to get a horse to listen to and accept contact? This is a lovely five-year-old mare who's quite green, but as you can see, she's accepting the contact quite nicely. I'm doing a lot of circles, 20-meter circles. They are the golden rule, 20-meter circles, to work on suppleness and acceptance of contact. We don't want the circles small because I want my horse to go freely forward into the bending aids to increase the suppleness. You can see that I'm doing some changes of bend, changes of rein from 20 meter circle to 20 meter circle, big changes of bend where I'm able to keep the balance. And that's super important for my horse to be able to accept contact is that they're balanced. If they're unbalanced, they're tense. If they're tense, they cannot relax into that connection. So you can see even going down the long wall that I have her slightly, ever so slightly flexed bent to the inside, asking her to stay stepping from my inside leg, from my inside aids onto the wall into my outside rein and another lovely 20 meter circle where I'm trying to keep exactly the same connection and exactly the same forward feel for the horse. This forward idea, super important. Now, at the end of this video, this is showing that my five-year-old um, stepping nicely forward into the canter. She's a little bit straighter in the canter than in the trot, and that's important for balance in the canter that she doesn't bend too much to the inside. Because of the nature of the canter, if I had her really bent to the inside, it would unbalance her, which again makes them tense. It makes them nervous when they're unbalanced. So nice long lines, steady, steady connection, a few circles. Here I put her haunches in a little bit. And all that this is showing, we're just beginning the work in the half pass and the leg yielding work and maintaining the connection. So as to reiterate, what we want first off is a nicely forward, confident horse. Then the rider can actually help a lot by staying balanced and staying quiet. A bit that's comfortable is super important. A nice snaffle is usually the most appropriate. And working on the lunge line to get the horse so that it accepts the contact even before you get on as a rider and try to get them to accept the contact is also really, really helpful sometimes. 20 meter circles are the golden rule for getting a horse to step forward into the work, give you a little bit of suppleness, learn how to relax into the bend. So anyway, I hope that helps a little bit. Have a great day.